hello again welcome back to my channel today's beverage is water i've been trying to drink more water i have been drinking so much water at work i'm up all night running back and forth to the bathroom i've been drinking so much water but it's good for me my body needs it so there we go but i really need to sit this somewhere where i'm not getting makeup powder in it shannon is shedding all right guys <sighs> how are y'all doing today i'm going to be using my new ulta beauty eye primer trying something different guys yes i'm breaking out from that elf primer i wanted the nyx one but ulta didn't have it so i'm trying this one and just gonna pat it between my fingers I wore it yesterday and seemed to do really good. And I did use a glitter, Ulta glitter. So, um, do I have it sitting here? Yes, I do. I used this glitter on my eyes and didn't really seem to have any issues. So, that was fantastic. Um, I'm going to grab just some face powder to set that. Put you up. So how is everybody doing today? Is it finally starting to feel like spring at your house? Lordy, I saw people were getting snow, like a big snowstorm. When I got up today, I believe it said the Midwest got like a big arse snowstorm. It's crazy. I'm just going to pat, pat, pat. And... The palette I pulled out for today is Dream Street. I love this little palette. So I thought I'd yank it out today. We might use some of the blues. I finally got a shipping notice on my Jeffree Star palettes. Lord have mercy, children. So it may be here for my birthday. We'll see. Um, I haven't checked it today to see where it's at. I did get it. Was it day before yesterday? And, of course, it's not going to update anything for 24 to 48 hours, so I didn't even check it. Um, so, I may check it today. I've not checked it today. And I'm just fluffing on that peachy shade. Just fluffing, fluffing. Nothing heavy. Just fluff, fluff. And so that was this peach shade up here. These blues right here. This one is so pretty when you put it on. Um, I think I'm just going to go over here and we're just going to build up that transition. And we're just going to pat, 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 pat. Oh yeah, that's plenty. Plenty of color. all I need right there guys I think we are down to 79 days on the cruise oh, we're getting there oh man I remember when we first done it and it was like 300 and something days and I was like oh my gosh we got like a, over almost a year to wait on this thing now we're down to a little over two months can't believe it I'm super excited I know y'all are sick of hearing about it, but let me know if you guys have been on a cruise. What did you think about it? Would you do another one? Do you have one planned for this year or have one planned, you know, next year or want to do one? What's your favorite cruise line? All right. This is going to be a super simple eye look today because that is pretty much how we're going to do. I'm going to come into that chocolate brown on the bottom with just this little round look. See? Just right, just keeping that really right there in that little V area. It's really simple. I still have some glitter from yesterday floating around on my face. And I just did my nails and I did them in a hollow glitter. So that's probably floating around a little bit too. I don't know if you can see the glitter. A little bit. You can see a little bit of the glitter. Um... 
So I may actually take a little bit of concealer. This is just a Shop Miss A concealer. It was like that really light one. I didn't mean to get it on my lashes because when you get it on your lashes, it's like, bleh. I'm just going to clean off my lashes a little bit there. Or make it worse, one or the other. I don't know. <laughs> I'm just going to pat this with my finger just to kind of brighten that space back up. Not a cut crease. Just kind of brightening that back up. Okay, then I'm going to come in with a little bitty vintage brush. We'll put you back where you go. Maybe. A little bitty vintage brush. That's one from the BoxyCharm. And I'm going to come in with this dark teal blue out here. And just kind of put that up against that chocolate. Not all the way into the corner, just kind of right beside of it and in this toward the center. And I've got a message. Okay. And then I'm going into this baby right here. And oh my goodness, this is why I love this palette. These shimmers in here are so pretty. And I'm just kind of blending it right over the top. I see notifications popping up. Now I don't want to lose all that dark blue, so I'm going to come back in just on the tip and just kind of Pat, pat, pat. Pat, pat, pat. And I'll go ahead and take a little bit of that. Sweep it underneath there. Not too much. Um Clean that brush off really, 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 really good. My switch. I'm gonna come into this light shade and just tuck it right up under the brow. Super simple, super easy, quick. I mean, optics don't have to be crazy complicated. You can get a very pretty eye without, you know, being super complicated. This is just bronzing, bronzing up a little bit. Do so you have to be at work, hence red shirts. I'm working in with my manager today, so that's always fun. He's, he's fun. Jimmy, if you watch this, he's always fun to work with. Yeah, I saw people are getting snow. Oh my gosh, that is like ridiculously crazy. Um, eyeliner. I think I'm going to grab the Architect again. I used it yesterday. I really like that. And I think we might be getting a felt liner in this boxy charm. I don't know. But if we are good, because I've gotten to where I really like these felt liners. So I can keep that line really thin. All right, that's it for the top. For the bottom, I'm going to grab the blue. This is NYX 
and it is gypsy blue and I'm just going to run a little bit of that under easy peasy easy peasy guys I got home last night and my hubby noticed the glitter on my eyes he's like whoa you glittered it up didn't you I was like yes I did <laughs> but then he's like do you have on falsies? I'm like, no. So I've been curling my lashes. And yesterday I used the Better Than Sex. So he said it looked like I had on falsies. Now I don't know. I'm going to try to cover up that mascara I got on my lash. I'm just going kind of over the top right there. So that's interesting. Guess they were just really, he said they were really thick and dark. So, there's his testament for the better than sex mascara. I mean, when your man notices your, your eyelashes, I mean, you know, usually it's like, eh, she's got on makeup, she always wears makeup. But when he actually notices, you know, something in, It makes you go like, hmm, I might need to use that some more if, if it's that good. And he, even he's paying attention. He can see it. I mean, you know, hmm. He said my bottom lashes didn't need mascara. So that's an interesting thought. So, but yeah, the bottom lashes don't need it. Why do you even put it on the bottom ones? Do you want the bottoms to match the tops? So, we well, may be using you again more. I'm just going to take my banana powder, my big brush. I don't think I have any fallout. So, I'll just go over. I do like this powder. I do. Um highlight. I'm just going to reach in my highlight drawer and I'm going to grab. I'm not even going to look. Let's just grab something. This is what I got off of if this may be too too peachy. Um, is Wish or Alley? I can't get it open and I don't want to mess up my nails. I just painted them. Um, I need my tweezers. Here they are. But it's called Magic Pro or Eye Magic. And it's, yeah, this is way too peachy. I don't know. It would be really pretty on the eye. Um, it was stamped. I believe this is like an Anastasia, the way that Anastasia had their stamped or embossed. Well, let's take just a little. See what happens. Because I bought this and I don't use it. I've used it a couple times. And if I don't like it, we'll um, go over it with something else. I'm going very light because this is so peachy. But I know you can see it a little bit up there. So that may be as much as I do. But it's called iMagic Pro. And you can find these on AliExpress, um, Wish. Here, I'll swatch it for you. I mean, it's really pretty. Look at that. It's very peachy. Be beautiful on darker skin tones but yeah it looks good with this orange on my eye so we will go, go with that and then I'm going to grab a blush and guys I don't never use this so let's grab that and I think I'm going to use that same brush I'm going to clean it off just a little bit and I'm going to kind of go into this Tuscan Sun and the Havana just lightly right here and let it blend up into that peach. So it's a little more pinky, so it'll add a little pinkness there. Just like that. And then you guys know I always take a brush 
just kind of buff back over everything so it's all nicely meshed together. Next up, brows. Who's been shopping their stash? Who's on a low buy? Who went into this year with a um, low buy? Are you sticking to it? I'm pretty much stuck to it. Um, as you guys have seen, not bought a whole lot. What I have bought has been pretty, um, like really affordable, except for, of course, the Jeffree Star release, but that was a birthday treat. Um, yeah, I really haven't bought anything. I mean, I already have so much, so. I think that's the mentality of a lot of us right now is kind of use up what we have all right face spray I might still have like a little squirt out of this one and I actually barely I want a full size of this this is the uh, ready set radiant by Tarte spray I have this in my um trash empties which should be the next video up, maybe. It just depends on how I put them in order. But there's a teeny tiny bit in there. And I thought, wait! And it smells like cucumbers. And you guys know I love cucumbers. So that looks really good, actually. So I think we're going to leave it right there. I felt like a couple little big drips hit my nose. So I'm just going to pat that in with my, here I'll get my sponge. Just to make sure all that got in there. All right, guys, that is it. Don't forget, I do have a giveaway going. It's good till the end of the month. So if you're interested in that, I will leave that giveaway video link down below. All you have to do is be subscribed to my channel. Mm -mm. I still feel like little droplets and go comment on that video just watch the video comment on that video this is Gerard Cosmetics I got this in that mystery box and this one I think my light has a short in it this one lights up it's got the mirror is this one a lip gloss I don't remember but I know it's pretty. See, there's the little... Oh. And it's called Pretty Penny. <laughs> I don't know, that light's kind of throwing me off I like to soften my edges I don't know why I don't I just like to kind of soften the edges of the upper lip all right guys that's it for this one be sure you check out that giveaway video because the next giveaway video is going to be the 1000 giveaway and I give a sneak peek of that in the empties video so if you haven't seen that one yet if I haven't uploaded that one watch for the empties video because there is a sneak peek of some of the items that will be in the thousand giveaway as always thanks for watching and I'll catch you on the next one